Hey, 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 everybody, Esquire here. Uh, this is an update of the uh, New Year celebration event. I uh, hope that I can give you some tips, uh, tricks, hacks, or whatever the hell you want to call it. No, it's not a hack. Um, but, yeah, I want to talk to you on how I approached it. Um, I'm really, for a low, I'm saying like, seriously a low cost, uh, increase my stats, something crazy. Um, I'll go ahead and show you that after I'm done. Uh, I'll talk about what I'm doing here. Uh, but, yeah, so everyone knows here is the event. Uh, and just looking at, okay, first things first. Um, the first thing you want to do is you want to look through the event uh, to see what what it is that they have here. Uh, and the, the reason why I say that is you want to figure out what you need to get. Uh, so for me, uh, I know that, you know, I, I could definitely use some pick me up on my curiosities and my guards. Um, so I focused on. Um, I'll show you what I focus on in a second. Um, but that's what I really focused on. And by me focusing on those two things, you know, there's a reason for the madness here. Um, it actually helped me. Um, it kind of like fed off each other. So by me increasing one thing, it helped me to increase the other thing. And I'll tell you, talk about that in a second. Um, so here's the strategy. What you want to do is you want to look through it, uh, figure out, you know, what it is that you need uh, to improve. Look through everything. So here are some uh, tier five uh, intensity gears. Uh, so if you need some of those, it's only 60 right there. That's cheap. These things are getting super cheap now. Um, you know, so, yeah, grab that, you know, it's. You're paying 60 for four, a level four. So you can get a tier five for 60. Um, so if you're somebody that's really close to getting that, um, getting that march, um, I guess the, uh, what's that, troop the troop march in the uh, airship pushed up to that uh, six star, you gotta look at that, you know? So that's the kind of thing you wanna look at. You wanna approach it to see, all right, what, what here is going to best fit into what I'm doing right now? right all right so that's where we want to start all right so what's next uh they have this other thing uh you get it by cl clearing your resources in your palace uh you also get it by hunting uh beasts you get a lot of beasts uh you get like 200 for hunting beasts so you get a lot um for something that's so easy as uh killing a beast so definitely i, I recommend doing that um uh, you know for me i was real close with my airship parts i focused on that uh, one thing I'm doing is, you know, I, when I get something, so I have a, a air, enough of my airship part to push me to that next level, but I'm holding off on that because, you know, my thing is these events are going to come and go. So, all right, I'm good where I'm at now. And now I just need to kind of build up, build up, stack up. So when that next event come, I could just lay out the load and then I could even push up even faster. So that's the kind of thing I'm thinking about here. Uh, but yeah, this is the easy part, uh, guards or um, clearing out your resources. All right. Now, uh, like all events, uh, we got the, the three challenges here. Um, the daily challenge, I don't know. It, it's not as easy as it used to be. Um, all right. Spin 300. Uh, that's pretty easy. Uh, gather 2 million. That's easy. Uh, recharge a dollar, what, 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 2,000 worth of gold, it's easy, 200 gold, easy. So some of that stuff is easy, but when you look at this stuff, this stuff doesn't even make any sense for what they're giving you. Help your allies anytime, whatever. You're going to help them or you're not. You know, if they need help, you're going to help them. Um, so that's kind of a no-brainer. Exchange 50 times for only 10 of these things, uh, sparklers, eh. I don't know if I want to go ahead and do that, even though if all them at 44, because they're not, you got to like spend hundreds of dollars just to keep going down the line. You know, it's like, whatever, man, is that worth a hundred dollars to me or a hundred coins? No. Um, and then make 60 trades in the uh, munitions. 
that's going to cost you a lot of coins uh, if you need that stuff. You know, if that munitions during the 60 trades is going to get you to the amount of uh, food or resources you need to upgrade your uh, castle. All right, do it. Uh, but if it ain't, just stay away from that. Just my opinion. Um, all right. So here are the two things. So for me, uh, two events. I look at the two events. This is the uh, curiosities and it is the guard weapons. Uh, so for me, I focused on my curiosities and guard weapons. The first thing I try to do is uh, manip manipulate um, you know, my, my formation to see if there's a way that I can naturally, without even upgrading anything, get that push up. Um, and I wasn't able to do that with the guard weapon. However, uh, I was able to do it a little slightly with the um, curiosity. So that's the first things first. First things first, try to get it without spending any money because that's going to help you down the road. Um, so then after that, I like, all right, well, let's see what's the easiest way for me to upgrade, um, you know, to get, I guess, what's the easiest way for me to get more of these, uh, little sparkler things, because that's going to help me, you know, down the road. Uh, and this is what I did. Uh, so basically, you know, I worked on increasing my curiosities uh, and because, you know, that's was for me the easiest thing to do. It's the cheapest uh, thing to do. Uh, and that helped me by giving me these things here. So I got, you know, all this um, and let me show you what I did. So what I did is I went back to the store anytime I had enough um of the sparkly things i came in and i bought this uh this book here now this is the musketeer guidebook this is going to this is the highest level of the curiosities so you need 200 uh to get to the next to get that and i guess you know as things when the things first come out you get books for free uh, so I had, I think about 50 or so. It's so like, all right, good. So I was just buying that. And I was like, all right. So now I was looking around and I noticed that when I went here, now you're not going to see it here, but for a dollar, you were able to get like uh, 17 or something like that. Um, 17 of these sparklies for like a dollar. You're able to buy like five of them. You know, so you think about it, you buy, you know, five and then you know, seven times five is so right now you, you can get another extra two guidebooks. Uh, and then you look here, you know, for twenty five for five dollars. Now, this is in rupees. I don't, I don't know why my phone's acting crazy, but, you know, so now I looked at it. And said, All right. How many books do I need? And I looked at it in two ways. Um, first, I looked here. Yeah. Sorry, I looked here and said, all right, well, at that point, I was at 100. So I said, all right, so I need 100 of those books. If I spend or around 90, 90 of those books, if I spend 40, 50 dollars, I can get 90 of those books. So I was like, all right, so I was thinking that I want to spend that money. I'm like, I don't know why I'm pull the trigger that 50 dollars. 50 dollars is a lot. You know what I mean, um, so what I did instead is I did the sparklies. Boom. So for five dollars, I'm getting two sparklies. You know, multiply that by so you know another what four? Oh, my battery's dying. I multiply that by like five. I was able to get the hundred books that I need using my little sparklies here for twenty five dollars versus, you know, when you're not really, you know, analyzing stuff, spending. Spending a lot more, you know, spending fifty dollars, you know, yeah, I get other stuff, but do I really need it? No, I don't. 
so yeah, so that's pretty much uh, the strategy. You just got to be smart about it. Uh, so what I did is I increased uh, the curiosity. And what that did is that gave me uh, more points here. And I used these points. Uh, so once I got my, the curiosities I needed, I used the points to get blah, blah, blah. These thingies, these lava crystals. Now with the lava crystals, I then went to uh, and kind of reconfigured my... Boom, boom, boom. Sorry. I reconfigured my Royal Knight um, weapons and I was able to get extra points. So then I was able to reconfigure it more. You know, so that's how you want to do it. You got to kind of have it play off each other. Uh, it may take spending some money. You know, for me, I did spend, but I, I spent it very well. I, I didn't spend much at all. Uh, looking at my current stats, uh, where I'm at. Yeah. Now, what I've been focusing on is my uh, troop attack and stats and my infantry stats. Uh, and, you know, now I got them. Uh, I'll show you. You know, and then after that, focus on my cavalry. Uh, and then the distance is last because the distance is, you know, usually the last to get into the battle to get mixed up. Uh, so I lost to this dude. So who's this? All right. So I lost. But, you know, looking at my stats here. So I'm almost at 1300 for all of my troop stats. And I got a couple of my uh, my infantry uh, in the 3000s, you know, and I use very little money. I use less than a hundred dollars to over the last like I can't remember when it was like 25 something. But by doing things strategically, smartly, uh, you can get you can get a good bang for your buck. You're not going to be you know, leader of a rally and all that other stuff, you know, when it comes to KVK, but you can hang in there. Uh, so hopefully this video helped. Uh, I don't know what's going to come tomorrow. I may release another one to kind of explain strategy looking at uh, tomorrow's um, challenges. Um, but I don't know. We'll see how that goes. Anyway, y'all, thank you very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Really appreciate your support. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe and hopefully uh, this uh, outlook and view uh, helped you or will help you with your picking the right option or object. <laughs> All right, let me get off. I'm, I'm kind of like stumbling over here. All right, y'all. Have a good one. Please subscribe. Thank you for your support.